Good afternoon, Gardening Family. So it is mail call time again, and I am so excited about this box. So guys, I recently um, went on a trip to California. It was my first time ever in California, and I went to uh, Palm Desert, which is, uh, I think about 15 minutes or so from Palm Springs. So I was in the Palm Springs area, Coachella Valley area, and I found this awesome, awesome farm that I wanted to go to. It is a date farm, and it is called Sam Cobb Farms. This farm um, is a date farm. And when I say date, I'm talking about those delicious, delectable dates that come on palm trees. And this particular farmer, uh, Sam Cobb, is the only African-American date farmer in the United States. And I had the absolute pleasure of being able to speak with him for a little while one morning. And when I tell you, he was just awesome. Uh, just getting to talk with him and hear a little bit about his story and how he started his farm was just amazing. So I couldn't take a tour of the farm because I wasn't going to be there long enough uh, and I was going to miss uh, the Saturday tour, but I had to order some dates. So this is my box. Shipping was super, super fast and I have been waiting to bust this open for a day now or maybe two because I wanted to do the mail call and share it with you guys, but I can no longer wait. This has to happen. So, let's get in here. All right. All of that stuff out of the way. And then, okay, so I have three packages. So, I'm going to tell you what I got. Uh, uh, and there is a note on here <laughs> so it says hello Deidre thank you for your date order it was nice to meet you over the phone I decided not to share that quite yet stay tuned enjoy sincerely Sam Cobb so that's so awesome I think I'm going to keep this <laughs> but this one that he put it on uh, is bar heat dates I've actually never had these before, but bar heat dates, don't know what those taste like, but I'm going to be tasting them in a moment. Mm -hmm. but look at those dates. And the day that I talked with them, they were actually harvesting dates. I don't know, these could be some of the ones that were just harvested. All right, and then the next one, is a jumbo medjool date now i have actually had medjool dates before um prior to maybe about two three months ago i'd actually never had dates before um i never even tried them but my husband has fallen in love with them and we are buying them like you would not believe so uh, when i had the opportunity to order these from mr cobb I wanted to really try them. So these are his Jumbo Majuls. And these babies are huge. But never had a Jumbo Majul before. I've had Majuls before, but not Jumbo Majuls. So I'm gonna be tasting that as well. And this one, guys, is the one that I wanted to taste the most. Look at these babies. Yes. So this one is a black gold date. This black gold date, guys, Mr. Cobb made this date. This is actually his date. He's actually um, created three. And this one is the most popular one. And the black gold uh, is called that for a reason. So let's see. I'm actually going to see about tasting these. And it is super late now. So I really shouldn't even be eating these right now. But I'm gonna at least taste this one so that you can see. Oh, this is closed really well. Okay. On a momento. Okay, got her open. All right, look at these babies. Okay. All right, so the black gold date 
is called that because of uh, a couple of things and I'm going to show you momentarily so here's what it looks like and I'm going to take a look to taste a good date oh wow mm, and dates are so sweet these things taste like candy so let me tell you why he calls it a black gold black gold look at this date guys the inside is gold the outside is black and the inside is gold I have never seen that before I've eaten I think two different kinds of dates and this is the only one I've ever seen where it's actually gold in the inside. Mm. I love this. <laughs> this is a delicious date. Wow. Yeah, that's awesome. If you're watching this, Mr. Cobb, thank you. This is delicious. You should sell these nationwide, sir. Not just on your site. I'm just saying. <laughs> this is so good. Mm. Okay. So. What comes out? I said it's late, but once you start eating these things, it's like. I can eat maybe two or three of them because they're so sweet. But, gosh. Mm, let me show you what the date seed looks like in case you've never seen it before. That's a date seed. This is a black gold date seed. <laughs> Just to give you guys some reference point, I actually have some date seeds sitting here that because we eat so many of them and we have some seeds just kind of sitting these are my jewel date seeds these are regular my date seeds that we've saved and this is the black gold date seed mm -hmm. yeah. pretty cool the black gold is considerably smaller than that uh those medjool ones that I have, and those aren't jumbo medjools, those are just regular medjools. But we're gonna try this bar here quick. I hope I'm saying that right, probably not. All right, so these are lighter, pretty color. Let's give it a taste. Hmm, that's different. It's like milder than the black gold. I would say the black gold is much sweeter. Both of them are very, very sweet. But this one I would say is not as sweet as the black gold. Mm -hmm. And let's see what it looks like from the inside. Oh, so that actually has a little bit of like gold on it as well. I know I haven't seen a gold on the medjools that I've had. That, that seed's actually small on that one too. This is the black gold right here, and this is Bari. Mm -hmm. Okay, one more. <laughs> I'm gonna try it. This is the Jumbo Medjool. Gosh, and these are so big. This is definitely the last one, because these are so sweet. Uh, let me see if I can find the smallest Jumbo one. Oh gosh, that's huge. Yeah, let me go with this one. So, 
this is the last one I'm gonna try, and this is his Jumbo Medjool. Let's close that, and let's see what this tastes like. That is sweet. That is big. <laughs> That's a huge date. So, it's soft. It has some gold, but not like the black gold. Look at that. It's definitely a marked difference between this and the black gold. Mm. It's good. I think for... For me, if I were to eat the jumbos, I probably could only eat one at a time. This is so sweet and it's so big. And at this point, I'm on a sugar overload. And there is the seed from the jumbo, which also is considerably fatter than the regular Majul ones that I have here. And this is softer to me too. I don't know. It's very nice. Anyway, it goes. It's just very nice to me. So, at the end of the day, I would just say, guys, order you some dates. <laughs> try these I definitely would recommend the black gold because again like I said he is Mr. Cobb is the only African-American date farmer in the country um, one of his farm um, farms is about a hundred acres I think he said and I would love to see it one day but Try it out, guys. This is history, <laughs> which is one of the reasons that I had to try it. This is history. So, I love it. Well, again, Mr. Cobb, if you're watching, thank you so much for sharing your dates with us. I think my husband is going to love all of these. I don't know. This this might be his favorite. But I think he's going to go love them all, which I do. They're all delicious, and they taste fresh. I can tell you that. Based on the ones that we are used to eating, none of them have tasted as fresh as this. It tastes great, but none have been this fresh. These taste wonderful. So thank you again to Sam Cobb Farms for the awesome date and for the wonderful conversation and for getting to meet you. So thank you again so much. We appreciate it and I'm so excited for my husband to taste these. All right, guys, uh, that's it for now. If you like the content, please click like, share, and subscribe. And we'll see you in the next video.